Hi, everybody. Hope you all having a wonderful day. I'm Mr. Wildcat, or Carl, and you may remember me from being guest host on the Married Children podcast throughout season 10. I had the honors of, so far, appearing as a guest host on three episodes of the Married Children podcast, including Dub Bull 2, and as well as our two most recent episodes, Bud Hits the Books and Kiss of the Coffee Woman. Today, I'm coming to you guys with a different scenario. Today, I am going to be reviewing a famous product that has been mentioned a handful of times throughout married children's history. What product would that be, might you ask? Today, we're going to be reviewing Orange Julius, as mentioned by Marcy Darcy in Kiss of the Coffee Woman. Well, Bud is selling maps to stores for making horse public appearances. By the way, did you know that Michael Keane is down to Orange Julius as we speak? So we got Orange Julius here. Do not be fooled by this cup, okay? It says DQ on a Dairy Queen. The thing is, that's where, um, just, just, just that's where most um, Orange Julius locations are located in. They share a space with Dairy Queen, especially out here in Arizona, okay? So I'm going to be reviewing exactly what we have to offer. So there's a whole different wide variety of different options on the menu. Okay. Not every location is going to have every single item on this menu. But um, whichever orange juice you want to pop it into, there's going to be a hand, at least a handful of different options to choose from. The one we're going to try out today is the original Orange Julius, which is the flavor that gave Orange Julius its name. But in addition to that, they have a wide different variety of signature fruit drinks, as well as healthier options with fruit smoothies. So the other signature drinks they have to offer include, but are not limited to, strawberry banana, peri bon gratte, mango pineapple, orange berry, pina colada, strawberry, strawberry watermelon, and triple berry. And for those of you looking for smoothies or healthier options, they also offer banana chill, strawberry watermelon sensation, mango pineapple premium, orange berry extreme, pomegranate berry blessed, strawberry banana premium, strawberry premium, triple berry, triple colada, tropical tango. Okay, so these are the different drinks they offer on the Orange Julius website. The one we're going to try out today is the original Orange Julius, okay? Now, I do have to warn you guys. The original Orange Julius flavor does have milk and egg product because that's what gives the drink its frothiness. So if you are a lactose intolerant or have dairy allergies, the original flavor might not be for you. But don't be discouraged because they do offer a wide variety of smoothie options that are completely dairy free. And as an extra bonus, you also have the option for, for additional 99 cents, regardless of which size you purchase, you can add a boost to your Orange Julius drink. You can add protein in there. You can add vitamin C. You can add a whole bunch of different oxidants and stuff in there, etc. okay? So we're gonna go ahead and take a taste. And I'm going to show you and describe to you what it tastes like. And then I'm going to give you my rating. And for the rating, we're going to use the exact same rating system that the Married Children Podcast uses to rate their episodes. Okay? Cheers. Mmm. Okay, so the original Orange Julius, is like, to no one's surprise, there is an orange flavor in there, okay? And it kicks really, it has, it's, re it's a really strong taste. In addition to that, there is, a, it's kind of like a sweetener type, uh, I think it's like vanilla or sweetener or something like that. It makes the drink pretty sweet, all right? And you can definitely taste it. So let's 
take another sip to see if there's anything else I can endeavor. So for the most part, um, it's kind of like a, a very sweet, I would probably describe it most likely as a very sweetened orange juice, okay? With a pretty strong kick to it, okay? So that's what I, so that's how I would describe the original orange juice flavor. So for my rating, um, I would probably, the orange Julius I wound up going to was it's a it's a fifteen minute drive, so I wouldn't be able to drink this on a daily basis. But if I had something closer, I would definitely stop more often. Okay, this is something I probably would definitely drink, not on an everyday basis, but something I would enjoy on a but everything you know, I would enjoy every now and then. Okay. So basically, uh, if I was to give this the same kind of rating that one of our Married Children podcast guest hosts were to rate a typical episode of Married Children, I would rate um, this particular uh, drink a 5 out of 5, all right? That's how much I like it, all right? And if you guys are ever come out to the West Coast, find yourself an Orange Julius, and I can definitely tell you, you will not be disappointed, okay? That is all I have for today. And I invite you guys to join the Married Children podcast team as they review the remainder of season 10 with Torch Sean Duet being the next episode this upcoming Wednesday and the jokes on L the week after. If you have not subscribed to the Married Children podcast channel, I advise you to do that so you don't miss any further episodes of the Married Children podcast. And while you're at it, come visit my channel, Mr. Wildcat. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out any more of my videos. Until next time, I'm Mr. Wildcat, saying so on and whoa.